Hello guys, today is, it's been a while since I haven't uploaded uh, any video for a, while, for a bit now. In this video, we are going to show how to connect to our SQL Server 2005 Express database using our C Sharp Windows application. I've created uh, my C Sharp Windows application now here and with the name of SQL Server 2005 Express WA which means Windows Authentication. Okay. Before we start guys, be sure you have a SQL Server 2005 Management Studio. Okay, here, click on the My SQL Server 2005, expand it, and then click on SQL Server Management Studio Express. Okay, guys, if you don't have S Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio Express, you can download it for free at Microsoft. Okay. After that, in the authentication part, we have a Windows Authentication here and SQL Server Authentication. Choose Windows Authentication. Add the database. Let's expand it for a bit. By the way, my server is a cosidan pc backslash SQL Server Express. SQL Server Express is my default instance name for my database and acosidan-pc is my server name okay this is my database here this one for the system database here you can find master my enrollment system database here and this sample here is my sample database for this tutorial if you want to create a new sample database right click on this database then choose new database Type the database name here, then click OK. Okay, after you create your sample database, let's go back now to our Windows application. Let's design our form for a bit. Let's drag some button here. Type the um, change, I mean the text of the button into Connect Me. And then let's drag some label here, status. Control C, Control V to paste it. Let's leave it blank. Oops. Okay, guys. Now let's double click on the form. I no, I mean the button to start the coding. Okay, now we are here. Before we start the coding, we need to declare first our import. Our import is necessary. Let's type here using space system that data that oops that should be that SQL client. Since we are using SQL Server 2005 Express, this is our necessary import. Okay, after that, start the coding now. Let's there declare our global variable SQL connection. Let's type your SQL connection. Con is equal to new ah, my keyboard SQL connection. Don't forget semicolon, guys, because this is C sharp. Okay, if you notice, I declare SQL connection variable outside the private void button one because it is declared as global, meaning every part of the class form one can access it. But if I declare the SQL connection inside the private void button one underscore click, only the private void button one underscore click function can access it outside it no one can access it anymore okay after that let's type here conduct connection string to specify our connection string quotation mark server is equals to that double backslash in C sharp it does not recognize a single slash but in VB you just need a single backslash but in C sharp you need a double backslash 
because it does not recognize this escape sequence okay let's type here after that SQL Express by the way guys I used you can change that dot here into your server name the Aposidan dash PC but it is much shorter to use that rather than the server name itself doesn't it so I'm just going to use that okay in there database equals to sample oops and then trusted connection also to okay let's stop in our connection change the status of the label uh, text of the label too guys we now specify our SQL connection string Let's open our database if you want to close the connection just type here con that close okay now we're going to test if our program can really connect our SQL server 2005 Express database let's start debugging now Okay, click the connect me button and the status is connected meaning we are now connected to our SQL Server 2005 Express database <clears throat> thanks for watching guys and if you have a question just kindly leave comment into all this video and if you like this video kindly subscribe to my channel it will be much appreciated okay thanks again guys